look thinner instantly. Actually, the most important thing about this video is that I'm going to help you feel better instantly, feel better in your clothes. I have actually been a stylist and an influencer for over 12 years, and these 10 tips and tricks will definitely help elevate your looks. They will help you look and feel like a better version of yourself while wearing your clothes. But like I said, more importantly, they will help you feel better in our clothes because it has been so scientifically proven that when you like your outfit, when you love what you put on and you feel confident and like the best version of yourself, you actually alter your brain chemistry. You increase dopamine, you increase serotonin levels. This will obviously increase your mood. It will help you perform better at work. It will help you in your relationships. So getting dressed every day, ladies, is definitely not just about the clothes that we put on our bodies, but it's about how those clothes make us feel and how those clothes make us interact with other people. So I am literally thrilled about this video. I honestly cannot wait to share these tips and tricks with y'all. Make sure you listen to the entire video because tip number 10 will definitely make you look up to 10 pounds slimmer. I'm all about we should feel good in our bodies. We should love our curves. We should love the way we look and the way we are. So this video is not about like telling you you should look a different way. It is simply about how to look better in your clothes. And like I said, feel better in your clothes too. All right, tip number one to look and feel like a slimmer version and better version of yourself is to go monochrome. So what does monochrome mean? Basically, that is wearing the same color head to toe. It doesn't have to be the same shade of the color. In fact, I love it when it's sort of like a tone on tone, maybe a lighter shade and a darker shade paired together, but wearing all the same color, I think it's not only incredibly chic, but it will definitely have a slimming effect on you as well. So you can't ever go wrong with all black because all black is obviously monochrome. It is also very slimming because anything that is darker, a darker shade is also going to help you look like a slimmer, taller version of yourself. So this is a good American long sleeve black midi dress, like super comfortable. It is um, a double jersey knit material. So it really does hug your curves in all the right places. I love this plunging V neckline and I love the midi length as well. And then I just Topped it with this amazing Balmain blazer. If you've never tried on a Balmain blazer, they are literally like the best fitting blazers on the market. They definitely have a slimming effect because they cut in at the waist, just like a well-structured blazer should be cut. And when I put on a blazer, I just feel powerful. I feel confident. So again, playing back to clothes are more about not really how you look in them, but most importantly, how you feel in them. And when I put on a Balmain blazer, I feel amazing. Now, if this one is out of your budget, no worries, because I do realize they're really expensive. The Lily Silk blazer is another option that is a little bit more budget friendly. The material is very high quality. It's wrinkle free. It's also a structured blazer blazer so it's going to cut in at the waist it's going to have a slimming effect and again you can't go wrong with a powerful black blazer if you don't own at least one well-fitting black blazer you absolutely need one Okay, tip number two in order to look slimmer and feel better in your clothes is to wear darker colors. So darker colors are always gonna have a slimming effect over bright colors, over pastel colors. Um, so think like black, navy, dark gray, chocolate brown. Chocolate brown is gonna be a huge color this fall and winter. And I'll have to say I'm a big fan because chocolate brown is one of my favorite colors. And that brings me to this long brown cardigan. So a bonus tip, anytime you wear a floor skimming cardigan, like a long duster cardigan slash coat, it's going to have an elongating effect on your silhouette. It's going to make you look taller and it's going to make you look slimmer. This brown cardigan is by Topshop from Nordstrom. So the price point is amazing. It's soft, it's cozy. It's literally the perfect fall cardigan. I paired it over this amazing black strapless ribbon sweater top from Express so the price point is very reasonably priced and then this is a great black denim midi skirt this one is by Reformation I love this midi skirt and in the denim world you guys denim midi skirts are trending really hard right now they've been seen on tons of celebrities and mega influencers and I really love this faded black denim it's a bit edgy which matches my personal style perfectly it is from Reformation like I said it does run true to size and everything I am 
am talking about today will be linked down below in my description box. And then these are some YSL low kitten heels. So very comfortable, very wearable. You guys are always asking me like, Heather, we need some comfortable heels that we can actually wear and walk around in during the day. And these are your answer. Okay, style tip number three in order to look slimmer and feel better is to belt your dresses at the thinnest part of your waist. And that's going to be different for everyone. But typically, the thinnest part of your waist is right underneath your rib cage. That's definitely where my thinnest part of my waist is. I have a couple of girlfriends, my daughter, like my mom. The thinnest part of our waist is always right underneath your rib cage. So I'm guessing that's same for you. You know what? Sometimes the dresses come with the little strings on the sides where the belt is built in. Well, you can just cut those strings off and then you can move the tie waist belt around. You can move it up is typically what you're going to need to do in order to get that cinched at the thinnest part of your waist. And this will definitely make you look taller and slimmer. I love this page dress. I didn't have to cut off the little straps, obviously, because they're belt loops. So I just moved them up a bit. You can sort of blouse over the top portion of the dress. That way it just made me look slimmer. It, you know, tied around my waist right underneath my rib cage. This is a great, easy summer dress. It's comfortable. It's fabulous. I love to wear it like on a date night, but then it's also really cool to wear just during the day with flats or sneakers like running errands. All right, the next tip in order to help you look slimmer is choose higher rise denim, specifically denim that is going to hit you right at the thinnest part of your waist. So like I said, you may not know what that is for you. So just go try on a bunch of jeans and then see where they hit you. You could also get out a measuring tape. You could also walk down the sidewalk on a sunny day. Look at your silhouette and you can see the thinnest part of your waist. So I actually did that. So for me, again, it's right underneath my rib cage. So I love to choose denim with a 12 inch rise. That's basically is gonna hit me right at that key area where my thinnest part of my waist is. High rise denim is going to make you look taller and slimmer because it's going to hit up higher on your waistline. It's going to elongate your legs. The higher the waistline and the longer the hemline, the longer the leg seam is. Obviously that's going to make your legs look longer. It's going to make you look taller and slimmer as well. So these jeans are by Mother. They are called The Rider, and they are definitely my favorite silhouette that Mother Denim makes because they are, I think, a 12 and a half inch rise. So again, they're gonna hit me right underneath my rib cage. It's perfect for me, for my silhouette. You know what, you could try these on. They have a lot of stretch in them, so they're extremely, extremely comfortable. I love this medium to light wash, perfect for all year round. They do have an ankle length, and I am five foot four for reference. And then I just paired these jeans with a shorter cropped white button down. This one is by Stodd. It has a very sexy sort of off the shoulder neckline. This is just a fabulous crisp white shirt, very classic, which I thought looked really good with these high-waisted jeans. All right, the next tip in order to look taller and slimmer is to always wear a nude heel or a metallic heel. So you could do a metallic gold heel, a metallic silver heel, or a nude heel. My personal favorite is gold heels. I have tons of gold shoes. In fact, if I had to pick the number one color of heels that I have in my closet, it would be gold, even over black. I love gold heels. The reason is they're always gonna make you look taller. They're gonna make your legs look longer because they blend in with your skin tone. I get it, some people can't wear heels. So if you don't wanna wear a four inch heel, wear a three inch heel. If you don't wanna wear a three inch heel, wear a kitten heel. If you can't even wear a kitten heel, that's okay. You can wear flats, but I would say choose a pointy toe flat because anytime you have a pointy toe shoe, whether that's a heel or a flat, it is going to make your legs look longer and you look slimmer. So when in doubt, if you have a round toe choice and a pointy toe choice, always choose the pointy toe. They're not only gonna make you look slimmer, but they're also just sexier and cooler than a round toe shoe. So these are some nude raffia wedges by Cult Gaia. I am wearing these heels and so is Sam. Sam is also an influencer. This is my Chic at Every Age group. We do a blog post once a month featuring one item and we all style it different ways. So we chose this Michael Starr's $88 dress. You guys, how amazing is this dress? It comes in light blue, it comes in black. It also comes in like 10 other colors, I think, including like olive green, tan. I have like four of these dresses 
because they're so comfortable. They're perfect to throw on in the summertime. You can top them with a jacket and a heel if you want to dress them up, or you could wear just like a gold slide if you wanted to dress it down but still look chic. Um, but again, you can see our legs look longer because our, our heels are nude. They blend in with our skin tone, and that's just gonna make our legs look longer and us look slimmer and taller. I topped my Michael Starr's baby blue dress off with this amazing denim jacket. It sort of blends in. So this is also a monochromatic look that I did, blue on blue. I really love it. I did the nude heel. So I'm really incorporating several of my key tips here in order to look slimmer in my clothes. All right, the next tip in order to look like a better version of yourself, a slimmer version of yourself, is to choose a cropped jacket, a fitted cropped jacket. The reason this is gonna make you look slimmer is because cropped jackets typically hit you at your waistline, and this is going to accentuate your waist. Anytime you can show off your waist, even if you don't have a waist, even if you carry some of your weight around the mid area, that's okay. Putting on a cropped jacket is going to create that waist. So I am absolutely obsessed with cropped blazers. I have several in my closet and I find myself wearing them a ton. This one is by ALC. It's a beautiful ivory cropped jacket. It has some gorgeous gold luxe buttons. I just love this blazer. I'm definitely gonna wear it in the fall and winter as well. I think there is nothing more chic than wearing like an all white ensemble in the fall and winter. So I will probably pair it with some white jeans and boots come fall. But for right now, I paired it over a simple white bodysuit. And then this is an amazing denim mini skirt by Hudson Jeans. This is so comfortable. It's a great alternative, especially in the summertime if you want to wear denim but you don't want to be so hot you can wear this denim midi skirt because it's definitely cooler than wearing a pair of jeans and then i went with my own rule choosing a pair of metallic gold heels these are by colt gaia the heel height is only three inches so these are very wearable and very comfortable okay this tip is probably one of my favorites and that is choosing to wear the most universally flattering style of denim, and that would be the high rise flare slash boot cut jean. Hands down, the most universally flattering style of denim is going to make you look slimmer. They're going to make you look taller. And here's a couple reasons why. Reason number one, they're high waisted. So again, they're gonna sit higher on your waist, making the length between the waist and the bottom of the jean longer. So obviously it elongates your legs, making you look taller and slimmer. The floor skimming hemline means you can wear a platform or a heel underneath the jeans, and that's going to make you look taller and slimmer as well. These jeans are amazing. They're by Legeance. They are such a great fit. Like literally they hug your curves in all the right places. They're so comfortable. They do have a little bit of stretch in them. And I really love this sexy slit up the ankle. I paired him with a white leather blazer. This one is by Karen Millen. So it is, I think it's gonna be 20% off. I'm gonna ask them if they'll honor my code. But this is a great leather blazer. It is real leather. It's a structured blazer. And like I talked about earlier, anytime you have on a structured jacket as opposed to an oversized jacket, that's also gonna help you look like a slimmer version of yourself. This blazer honestly reminds me of a Balmain blazer, but instead of being like, $1,500 to $2,000. This one is very reasonably priced for a real leather blazer. And I touched on this a second ago, but structured jackets. This is the next tip. Always choose a structured jacket over an oversized jacket, whether that be a leather jacket, a blazer, a denim jacket. Just choosing a fitted jacket is going to help you look like a slimmer, taller version of yourself. So this is a Good American matching set, a black top with a black maxi skirt. And then I topped it with this fitted brown leather jacket. I think this one is by a firm from the Nordstrom website, but I loved this brown, beautiful shade, you guys. And as you can see, this is a structured jacket. If this was like an oversized leather jacket, it wouldn't show my figure off as much and it wouldn't help me to look like a slimmer, better version of myself. I love this leather though. It's so soft, it's so comfortable and this beautiful rich brown shade, like I said earlier, is going to be huge this fall and winter, so this color is very on trend. Okay, two more tips to go. So tip number nine is to always choose a V-neck line 
or a scoop neckline as opposed to a crew neckline. The reason this is going to work is because anytime you have a V-neck or a scoop neck, it elongates this top portion of your body, making you look taller and slimmer. Bonus points if you add a neck stack. I have on my go-to chain necklace that I literally wear almost every single day. And then this is a Fondren coin necklace that I got a few years ago. I always wear them together. It just has an elongating effect. It's sort of part of my signature style. But this is probably another one of my favorite style tips that I swear by. I just don't feel complete unless I have on a V-neck, a scoop neck with my go-to neck stack. So as you can see, I have on my neck stack and a really cool V neckline in this Topshop ruched strapless top. It actually has a deep V here right in the middle of the chest. So very sexy, but tastefully sexy, right? And then I just topped it with a denim jacket. And then this is a brown maxi skirt. So maxi skirts are another way, especially if you pair them with a heel like I have here, that are gonna make you look taller and slimmer, especially if they have ruching on them, especially if they're form fitting and especially if they're a darker color like this beautiful chocolate brown. This is another piece that I'm really excited about for fall because again, chocolate brown is gonna be one of the hottest colors this fall. So I really loved how this outfit turned out. Okay, tip number 10, and this one is probably the best one that will certainly make you look up to 10 pounds slimmer. And it is always wearing a pair of Spanx when you wear a form-fitting dress or a midi skirt or a midi dress or anything that's form-fitting. These particular Spanx basically hit you above the rib cage and they come about a few inches above your knees. Literally, they hold everything in. They will make you look just like a better version of yourself. They will smooth everything out. Like honestly, anytime I have on a form-fitting dress or a mini skirt, I always wear these Spanx. Sometimes if I forget to put them on and I'm walking around, I can totally tell because things just don't, aren't as tight and aren't as held in. So these will make the biggest difference. I highly recommend them. I love them. I recommend them to all my clients, all my readers, and everyone swears by them. So if you don't have a pair of Spanx that you love, I would say definitely get your hands on these. So those were the 10 tips on how to make you look slimmer and most importantly, how to make you feel better in your clothes because ultimately that that is what it's all about, feeling like the best versions of ourselves. Every day when we get up and we're able to put on some clothes, they should be working for us. They should be helping us look like the best versions of ourselves. And I hope this video helped you do just that. For more style information, you can head over to SoHeather.com and on Instagram, I'm SoHeatherBlog. I hope you have a beautiful day because you deserve it and I will look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye.